Would you like some clarity on your business finances on a weekly basis? Well, I'm gonna be sharing how you can do that in a simple way today. How is it going everybody? Craig here and I'm a profit advisor and financial coach who's passionate about helping small businesses take control of their money so that they can pay themselves more and love their business more. Now, most business owners don't really know what's going on with their money. They may look at their bank account uh, here and there, but there's a lot of blurred vision when it comes to what's going on in there. Now they could might look at a cash flow statement or a PL and looks great and everything, but most of them don't know what to do with that information. And it's just business as usual. We'll look at the bank account. Do we have enough to do this? Do we have enough to do that? And if so, we move forward. But what we run into a lot is all that cash lumped in together. You're spending money on operating expenses and there's not enough to pay yourself or you pay yourself too much and there's not enough to pay an invoice for uh, one of your expenses. And so how do we get that clarity of how we're doing in each portion of our business right there from our smartphone? Well, I'm going to dig into that and it's all based on something called Profit First. Now you've heard me talk about it if you've been on this channel before. Uh, Profit First is a book by Mike Michalowicz. I'm happy to give you the first two chapters right up here with that link. Uh, I'll email it directly to you. Dig into it. It's going to change your life. If you haven't read it before, if you haven't heard of Profit First before, get ready. If you're a business owner, it's a must, an absolute must. It's going to make you money from day one. And it's just going to take the whole burden of money and finances and managing it all off your shoulders. Now, what it does is it breaks it apart into those groups. So you have different bank accounts, the income, owner's pay, profit, taxes, and operating expenses. And so when you look at your bank account from your smartphone, you literally can see what you have in each section. Now, we're moving money around based on percentages. So... If you are less than a quarter of a million dollars in revenue, you might put 5% into profit. So as somebody pays you, if somebody pays you an invoice, you take 5% of it, move it to profit. You take a certain percent of it and you move it to your salary and then some to operating expenses and so on and so forth. The question that comes up is how often do we do this? When do we actually log into the bank and move those numbers around, put money into our profit accounts and so on and so forth? In the book, it says the 10th and 25th. That's when they recommend you hop in on the 10th and the 25th, you do those allocations. Personally, I like weekly. Weekly allocations is really, really powerful. It's done a lot for my business and it's actually what I recommend for most of my clients. Now there's nothing wrong with the 10th and 25th. There's nothing wrong with doing it uh, every other Friday or every other week. You choose what works best for you. Weekly works really well for me simply because it's easy for me to remember. On a Friday, it's in my calendar. I know every Friday morning, I log into my bank account, I move numbers around. That's also time where I can see how am I doing? How am I trending? What's going on? Am I gonna have enough to pay myself? Am I gonna have enough to pay my vendors? If not, what do I need to do? It's just weekly, once a week, I have clarity wrapping up the week on how I'm doing financially. Now, another reason is it's just, like I said, it's easy to remember. The 10th would sometimes fall on a Saturday and it would slip my mind and I would forget to do it on the Friday before or in, it would just suddenly be the 15th and I'm looking down and go, whoops, I never moved money around. So that's why I prefer that. I have some clients who like to do it when payroll runs. So they're saying every other week we run payroll, I'm gonna do it then. I recommend trying the weekly thing, even if it's just looking at the accounts. If you really want to do the 10th and 25th, that's okay. At least open up your accounts once a, once a week and just kind of do a status check. How are we doing? There's so many automatic payments that come out nowadays that it's really, if you're only in there every couple of weeks, there's a chance that one of the accounts could be dangerously low or possibly even in the red if you forgot about an annual subscription that's going to renew. And so being in there at least once a week is going to help lift that off your shoulders. All right. If you would like some help setting up in your business, a cash flow system that's going to just be simpler than you've ever imagined finances could be, let's talk. There's a link in the description below. It's a free coaching session. We're going to dig into your numbers and how you can be more profitable and pay yourself more money. All right. So click there. I'd love to talk to you. If you enjoyed this video, don't hesitate to uh, 
drop a like down there or subscribe. I would love to talk to you guys again uh, or see you guys again in a video. And I'd love to talk to you on a coaching session. So be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.